Hey guys, this is Archangel again here, and I'm playing today on uh, as my uh, naval battle today. And uh, my enemy is Assassin KZ666 on the new map Sea of Japan. Okay, so there's not much to say about this map because it's just ocean. There's no missile batteries or anything in here. But I've made this uh, video to show you this absolute monster juggernaut of a ship, ironclad, Lotion class. This is an absolute beast. I'll, of course, there's probably ships better than this, but God, this is crazy. I've only got two ships. This is the only ship, including my general ship, which isn't very good, of course, off his armor. And the ability can probably take uh, a lot of bullets. But only uh, nine cannons on this ship, and it only usually uses one or two. But 12 cannons on this ship, 12 big cannons. Look at them. And yeah, it's got 76 people. I'm just going to skip into the battle scene because this is boring at the moment. Oh, wait, no, let me show you the other army. So this is the army commanded by Assassin666. He has three, no, yeah, three, two Kasuga, three Kasuga classes. Um, he's got his wooden corvette Kankumaru class and his ironclad uh, Kotsu class general. So he's using all the Pomeranian general, all wooden ships. So I'm going to be firing explosive rounds off at them to see if I can get it to blow up and armor piercing his uh, his general, of course. Okay, so combat has started now. I'm moving my ship round, ready to attack. And there's the cannons already. Boom! And I've just activated the explosive rounds, I think and we'll see what these explosive rounds can do in a second. He's got all his ships firing at my ironclad. My ironclad just takes him like a boss. And look at that, a fire. And it's surrendered straight away. So that's one down. Ironclad one, their ship's zero. And he fires another round of shots at this ship now. It's explosive rounds again, I think, I'm not sure. My uh, general ironclad is engaged in combat as well now. And the wooden corvettes are still going straight at my ship, which means they can't get a lot of cannons off. Oh, and look at all those crew members swimming for their lives. I fear your Not general very well is in mortal peril, sir. And this ship's on fire as well now. Lots of fires. Another round of shots, and that's that ship surrendered. Ironclad two wooden corvettes nil. You got uh, a lot of shots off there into the water, and my ship's going to fire back in and show him how it's done. And another fire. What do you know? He's got two ships over here left still that my uh, general's ship is engaging, and another round of shots. And still, still on fire. He's, he's under repair, but it doesn't look like they're doing much. Let's have a look. No, he's just sitting down. And off it goes, it's routing, and on fire still. So now it's all down to the, um, the leather ship, it's compared to the Kazuka class, it's the Kankumaru class. So we'll see what this can do. Well, it, it's on fire, so that's a start, like the other ships. And a little standoff here, looks like explosive rounds are coming. Oh, nearly toppled it. It's on fire, well yeah, it's on extreme fire now. It doesn't look too good for the crew, does it? Let's have a look at them. Oh, they're on fire now. Oh, snap. I have sunk, well I've not sunk the ship yet, but that's, nah, that ain't bad. It's still steerable. Or not. And now it's all down to his ironclad who's fleeing, I think. It's, yeah, he's going pretty fast and the wrong direction. And you hear the screams of the crew members of this ship. What's he gonna do? Oh Jesus. Okay. He's just gonna stand there treading water instead of set on fire. Bang. I missed with almost all my shots there, which was pretty bad. But since this is the only ship left, it's wavering and it's still going very fast in another direction. It's wavering, it's wavering. Another round of shots should take it here. And here they come. And off it goes. So, a good game to our opponents, Assassin's KZ666. But don't bring wooden corvettes to an ironclad fight.